As the mainstream media continue to give platform and money to the most irrelevant politician of the year, Matt Hancock, GB News' Eamon Holmes has decided to hit back at ITV for being the wokest of the woke. All right, so we have already seen Matt Hancock in the jungle. He's been on various other programs and he's... I don't understand why they keep listening to him. <laughs> He's written a book. So that's a perfect excuse to go on uh, news channels to get interviewed to you know, plug his book. But one of the interesting things about this situation is, obviously, um, unsurprisingly, he is everywhere. Even on uh, various ITV shows, Dancing on Ice and everything else. And Eamon Holmes, who used to work with those type of mainstream media channels, but he's now obviously yeah, with GB News, uh, he decided to hit back and go quite robust and straightforward to the point when it came to the way ITV is as a channel, because not many people talk about ITV. Everybody's too busy when it comes to news. Everyone talks about Channel 4 News, BBC News, Sky News. But when it comes to the overall channels, again, people talk about Channel 4 for being woke, the actual channel. ITV gets away with a lot of things. And to be fair, they have some good programs, obviously. But the reality is they have this subtle wokeness uh, in most of their programming and the culture. This is the same channel that pushed out Piers Morgan. Um, and that is, <laughs> if, if you get rid of Piers Morgan, you've gone woke. So the, the interesting thing about this is uh, this clip. Let's go watch this. No, no. ITV is the cancel culture, the woke station of oh, all of them. Absolutely. And they, and they are the I ones who then offer that. this man 300,000 quid to come on a program. And I agree with everything that Sean said. He did say, Matt Hancock did say he was going to give it to charity and mention dyslexia. He mentioned dyslexia twice. And he gave like 10 grand to charity yeah, yeah. and kept the rest of himself. But he also protested... He wasn't doing it for the money. Well, in which case, give all of them. Yeah, money. can we also? I mean, I, I watched it back. Eamon Holmes. It seemed he seemed very passionate about it. I'm, I'm guessing something went wrong with his uh, relationship with ITV. Uh, that's why he joined the GB News anyway. Because at the time, everyone just assumed he's just bored. He wants to try something new. But the way he was saying it, I think something happened. <laughs> but anyway, we are going to be talking about the mainstream media as usual. Uh, but we have other important news stories for you guys. Uh, throughout today as well, the latest on uh, Sadiq Khan's EULAs, as well as uh, when it comes to ECHR and illegal migration. We're also going to be talking about um, the list trust and obviously the latest on uh, GB News controversies, as well as everything else in Scotland. So the best thing you can do is subscribe to the channel on my TC and we are the media.